The coming to power of the Jacobins, supported by the sans-culottes, inaugurated the most revolutionary stage of the French Revolution. The new Jacobin government, with Robespierre as the greatest exponent, will have as its objective a profound remodeling of the state, which materialized in a new constitution, where popular sovereignty and universal suffrage made Jacobin France the first modern state to enjoy a democratic constitution. Several laws that complemented this constitution were added, such as the laws of social equality that sought the well-being of the most popular classes. Also was established the obligation of all citizens to serve in the army due to the pressing internal situation, and above all external, of France due to the war that was being waged against the European absolutist powers. Precisely, what caused them the most problems was one of their laws. It was the law of suspects, whose objective was to prosecute all anti-revolutionary activities and strengthen the state against European war. This law did not produce the desired results and turned a large part of the population against the Jacobins. This situation was used by conservative groups to stage a coup, liquidate the government, and guillotine Robespierre and other Jacobin leaders. However, the guillotine will not be able to destroy their democratic ideals.